Alright, what's up guys? Drum Piper 11 back at you again. I, uh, yesterday I was in an antique store and looking around with my dad and we were just, you know, looking around for whatever. And I found me a new pipe. Um, this is in actually really good condition. How well you can see it with the lighting here. Let's see if I can stand up. But, uh, it sort of has a reddish hue to it. A reddish brown. It's made in England. On the bottom it says no weight, England made. It's a uh, about normal length, but it's a uh, quite a bit skinnier and smaller, kind of a small bowl. But uh, I imagine it's probably a 20, 30 minute smoker. But I'm about to light it up here for the first time. I hadn't smoked it yet, but I got some American Serendipity in it <coughs> over here at my buddy Jamie's house, and let him film for me. The orange bick. <laughs> it's not mine. It's his. <laughs> Music in the background. Thanks to Jamie. <laughs> the stem's actually kind of loose, but uh, it's not a huge deal. Oh yeah. Man, I love this pipe. <clears throat> kind of didn't want to spend the money because I just bought a, um, a church warden actually on eBay. I already told you guys about that. I hadn't come in yet, but um, I just saw this pipe and I couldn't resist. Um, I did kind of polish it up a little bit. I did also did the salt and alcohol treatment on the inside of the bowl. And uh, <clears throat> polish the stem up a little bit too. On the wood, I use some um, tea tree oil. And I got a little Dremel with the buffer bit, just kind of shine it up, made it look a lot nicer. Just trying to go out. <clears throat> but uh, it's in pretty good condition. I think it's. Either refurbished or uh, barely smoked. Just uh, looking at it. I mean, when I <clears throat> saw it in the store, it was in a little glass case, a couple other pipes with it, and uh, <clears throat> some of them were in pretty bad shape, but this stem looks, it just looked pretty much pristine. There was no bite marks or anything on the stem. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyway, it's in really good condition, so. <clears throat> couldn't pass it up. It was like thirty bucks. I, it, the price tag on it said like thirty-three dollars, and I asked the guy, "Can you go down at all on it?" And he gave me a ten percent discount, so that was pretty cool. It ended up being like thirty and some change, I think. I think it's a pretty good clincher. Really light, small. Got me a rubber on here to protect the stem, make it last longer. <laughs> Jamie's laughing over there because I said a rubber. <laughs> oh gosh. We've been cracking up all night, just <laughs> farting, having a good time. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> but he still won't show his face on camera. Nope. <laughs> Come on, why not? <clears throat> what you smoking over there? Cigar. <laughs> He's got one of those black stones I gave him for a birthday present, early birthday present. It's a vanilla black stone. But he's YouTube shy, so... <laughs> he said maybe one day. <laughs> but, uh... Because I know the camera will love me, and I don't know if I could deal with the fame. <laughs> oh. Anyway, just enjoying this uh, pipe. This is really nice. I've 
I'm so glad I bought this. Um, and your cat's in your car right now. <laughs> yeah, he's dead anyway. <laughs> anyway, I just want to share the first smoke of this with you guys. Um, love me some American Serenity Deputy. It's my favorite blend overall. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. Keep on piping.